I produce this video for the very simple reason that I want coaches to know thyself. Now look, high school coaches are going to run more toss than they do in college. And the reason why is because they're going to get stuck in more worst case scenarios than Army, Navy, Kennesaw, and the Citadel will. And they know, look, I just got to get the ball so far outside away from my offensive line that I don't have to worry anymore. I get that. I understand that. If you can't get four yards on the give to the B-back, if you can't get a yard on the give to the B-back on triple option, you got to get the ball off tackle with the zone option or outside with the toss. And certain guys are going to just go right to the toss because they want to get the ball so far away from the offensive line that they just want to get it to the sideline. So I get that. I understand that. If you're going to do it, you got to run the B-back toss. you got to run not just the rocket toss, but the B-back toss. So you have two ways to get the ball outside in a hurry. So you're going to install the B-back toss. How do you run the B-back toss? Here again, it's a triple stack. The receiver's going to take the charge on number one, meaning he's going to get in front of number one, cover him up, and make sure that number one can't go forward. That's the big key. The A-back is going to run the circle on number three. He's going to get his left knee in the crotch, left hand to the stomach, toes north. Tackle is going to open up, steal second base, and he's going to get his left knee through the crotch of the mic. The guard is going to steal second base, get his left knee through the crotch of number two. So theoretically, you're not getting the ball away from your offensive line. You're just making sure that it's you're not having to block inside with your offensive line. The center will sprint his belly button to the hip of the receiver. The backside guard sprints his belly button to the hip of the backside guard. Backside tackle sprints his belly button to the hip of the backside guard. Backside receiver cuts off. The B-back is going to steal second base. He's going to open and run, and he's going to catch the ball with his hands out wide two yards outside the tackle. When he secures the ball, he's going to break on a 45. He doesn't worry about this guy because... Corners want to make tackles probably about as much as you want to eat a salad without dressing right now. So he's going to break on a 45 break to the end zone. The quarterback reverses out, and then on his third step, he underhands the ball two yards outside the tackle. That's all he has to do. The A-back steps with his right foot first, and he piggybacks the backside tackle. So there you go. If you're going to run a lot of toss, you got to have two ways to toss the ball. The rocket toss, the b-back toss. I also will recommend the zone kick, but that's another video for another time. And Lord knows there's been enough videos I've produced on the zone kick, which you'll see a lot from Army this year. So, if you can't get a yard on the give to the b-back on triple, toss him the ball outside. Along with the rocket toss, you got two ways to get on the ball to get the ball on the perimeter. Because if you just run rocket all the time, it'll have a point of diminishing return. But this way, you can get more out of your overall toss game. Coaches, if you're looking to install the triple option offense the right way the first time, give me a call. 570-332-0265. 570-332-0265. The Triple Option Football Academy, it's $9.99. You get it for two years. With the Triple Option Football Academy, you're going to learn Army, Navy, and Paul Johnson's offense in a three-step progression to the number, to the data of how much they're running it in 2019. You're also going to get a 216 rep script to install it with your players. So you literally just follow the script, tell all 22 people where to go, and you'll never have to think ever again. They just execute it. The thinking is all done for you. There's also over 100 hours of drills from 16 camps that I did. You're going to see 16 camps run the triple option. You're going to see 16 camps run the toss. You're going to see all these different schools do it the right way the first time. And there's so much more. It includes a webinar with you and your staff, and I'm on call 24 hours a day. I've got clinics on there from six years ago that I produced. So much information, there's no way you can watch it all. And if you do, God bless you. So give me a call, and I'll see you in the next video. Talk soon.